looking pretty good. G'day there. I'm just checking out some of the concrete. They've got about three quarters of a ton in each of them. We'll show you a little bit about what we're going to use them for around the station. And then we're going to get stuck into throwing them out there, getting the station connected. Jack, you're better off explaining these things. No, well, I reckon the No, no, I do too much talking. Jack's No, 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 I, because this is, it's because you, you're doing the talking <laughs> is because it's evolving. Just the little things like here, we've got three different heights of these. This one is different to this one, is different to, to this one. Yeah, one, one's a repeater. Why have you got a small, is that for a smaller this, solar this, panel? This is your repeater with the big yeah, one. Yeah, I know that. But, yeah, but the reason you've got them apart is because you've used small bits here mm -hmm. and big bits. So the big one, it, naturally, it's got to be a little bit lower for it. Z channel. Who? Yeah, Z channel here. See, this one's a baby. This is a baby. Right. And this is a bigger one. So yeah. it's got to be corresponding. This has got to be down lower to fit with it. You, you can see down there you've got three of them the same, then that one different, that one different, and this one different. Yeah, why is that? I yeah, know it's, they're a repeater. Just, just just <laughs> this is a different size. To this one. To that one. Because it's shallow, it's a smaller piece of Z channel. So this has got to go, because this is up higher, that goes up there higher. This oh, is, so hang on, you like to talk in six. So you're saying the distance between here and here is the same. Is the, well, why didn't you say that first? The distance in, in here is the same as the distance in there and there, and the difference is because this one it's has a deeper, deeper recess. Yes. Did say that. Yeah, but we won't. Yeah, he did, but but in 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 Japanese and it was and, shorthand. He's still and working on the shorthand. And just for all of our viewers, for those that aren't in the construction business, <laughs> apparently this is a Z channel. Yeah. There you go. Right. Thank you. Right. These are going to be deployed as the base for our communication so you got to you know I always said jack you got a million acres and 38 wells and so that's the that's the challenge and how do you if you want to connect your whole station together you want to have observation on your water points with this model with this revised model you've got the flexibility to place these in the optimum position where you can see the the float for the tank you can see the cows coming in and out, you can check for ferals, you can uh, see if the gates open or close, so on and so forth. So it just gives us more flexibility because when we put these together, there is no other power source out there. So it's a self, it's a self-contained unit. Yeah. You've got solar power. We put out and we'll show you what the end product looks like, but you've got this is a bracket for the solar panel. This is the this is basically all your electronics and your power, which is both the battery backup and your um, solar panel. That comes into here. And then all of this is reused material, by the way. What were these originally used for? What is this? Drill rod. Drill rod pipes. So, okay. you know, to make your bore. Yeah. Okay. You use this to extend the length and you've got an air core, so it blasts air down it. And... Okay, so you go to Kmart. Oh, no, a... But you go to Kmart, you say, okay, we can use this as a thing. Because these are going to be picked up and lift it onto the back of the truck. Yes. With the crane truck, with the pack. Yes. And then same thing, lifted it off out Drop there, off. dropped off in the position, and then they're ready just to be wired up and they're in action. And we should roll four, four out. Well, I reckon you could roll six out in a day. But and the, beauty the, of this, and the beauty of this is that if you decide, okay, we want more, you know, more observation over here or we this well's gone dry and you've got to move to another well you just come along you pick this up you yep. move it to another spot and then drop it down so just i'm going to draw on the ground over here so this is what i understand jack you correct me if i'm wrong you have a house you. that's your house jack and we have a satellite and it's moving across the earth Right, this is Elon Musk. Hopefully now, don't get a now, yeah, no, it'll be all right. So this, you've got your, what's it called? Starlink. Star you have your Starlink on top of your house. That receives from there. Now, 
Now you've got 38 wells. You've got one here, you've got one over here, you've got one over here, you've got one over here. Up. <laughs> Where's the house? Okay. So here we put wells. If this is a well, we come over, we put one of those here. Okay, so now we've got our little camera watching the well, which is talking back to the house, which is talking up to there. But for this one all the way over here, so far away I can't find it. Here it is. No, it's not. Here it is. This one here, the house can't get to it. So in between Do you here, want to repeat it? You've got your hill. We've Here's got the hill. hill. Oh, on the hill. There, there you are. There's your repeat. So on the hill, we put a repeater so that Elon Musk can send his Starlink down to the house, which then sends a signal out to all of your close wells, but out to the repeater, which gives it a lot more energy, and then sends it onto this well here. And then sends back. And then sends back. Yeah. So that's basically, now we've got a million acres and 38 wells. So you've got to make sure that Elon can get to your whole million acres and all your wells. Is that right, Jack? No. <laughs> no, that's what I thought. You're also stuffed up a little bit because the system that actually operates completely independent of Starlink or any internet connection. Oh. So this, like, the station has its own intranet. Okay, so Elon doesn't have to be there. Doesn't, you know, someone decides to blow up satellites. Yeah. And we're on the station, we can check our water points because it's its own surface-based terrestrial yes. communications network that we've built. Ah. And then from the homestead, it's uploaded or is accessible ah. from the internet. But see, because I've, I've gone off now, I've left Dad's you. Dad's gone off to Esperance. Yeah. And he can see cows going right. into a set of yards. Oh. And he he can then control them even. So I've got to go through Elon to do that. You've yeah. got to go through Elon to do that. So to Yeah, so to talk to to talk back and forward, you need Elon when you're away from the homestead. Yes. But if you're in the homestead, your system that you've set up with your repeaters and all of these shuttles that we're doing spotted around the place, you you uh, you can you can see everything that's going on at your, your water points. Yep. Because out here and cattle, the most important thing is water. So the primary reason for putting all these points out there is make sure that your cattle have water so they survive. No, but we've got to give it the name. It's called, what have we come up with? Well, the Taj. Taj. Okay. Tim oh, Ant, Jack. Sure a Tim Ant, let's go over this one over here. I'm going to go the best one. This think... one's got the best concrete. No. Okay, okay. Who this... makes this lot? Probably me. This was the one where we did our first so... measured water. Okay, so this is Taj or Tag. How do you spell Jack? G A C K. Taj one. That is Taj one. Right, it's been christened. Yeah. Sure. Approach of that thing, you know, with the, the, yes. the establishing yes. like, tear in one of these, it's a okay. weak point. Yeah. Don't be obstinate. You watch, you watch. You watch how this is going to be. Now, Jack, your dad's mucking up our, he wants a yeah. face in this, I want a face so they all look forward. It looks uniform for the camera. So we've got Paco loaded up there with our rapid deployment kits. The TAJ Mark 1s, so Taj 1s and they are ready to go to become wireless monitoring units out and about on the station. 
So Dad and Andrew over there, and they're just finishing up with our new lifting rig, which you've already seen in action. Where are we putting this? Back of the middle. Okay, has it got a pre yet for us? Yeah, can you start lay, letting it out a bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, get out of the way now. No, then. no, I, it, I need to keep putting tension on. No, you don't. Oh. Right, you have it? Yeah, we've got it. I'm upwind of it, so if anything goes wrong, it goes that way. You can let it go. That's why you needed to let it go. Who's calling it? I'm calling it. Okay, let's go, Jack. Start walking it in. Okay. That's it. Yep, yeah, it's fine now, Jack. It's fine now. If you just, you just got to get rid of dirt and lace it back in. I've got him here, Ant. So, the 15 minute challenge kind of really starts now because we're standing here at two up and I've got the truck coming in. So we're going to work out our precise location that we're going to put it. And I almost think that all the deliberation that Ant and I had the other day would probably be pretty good just putting it straight here. So let's see how we go. Yep. Carbon Co. It's not good because you can't reuse the wire. Yeah. Okay. And what you want to do is just get this. Yeah. When you're doing, you normally do them with a screwdriver. Or it doesn't yeah. really matter what you yeah. do. You want that as close to the. To yeah. The yeah. It's just around. Oh yeah. It pulls yeah. right in tight. Yeah. Now you've now you've crushed the cable. Yeah. That's awesome. Okay. Now I'll show you. No, that's very good, Tim. I like it. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Right, good. So we've just installed Taj 1 3. It's actually the first one that we've thrown out. And Dad's just about to roll off to Brumby now. So we can get the next bit going. What do you reckon, Ant? Is this better than G the um, battery model? I'm not convinced. Um, I think it's a hell of a lot of weight for what seems to be a pretty um, light top end assembly. So I think it's a bit of overkill. And the other thing I don't like about it is that it forces you to work at height. Whereas with the battery model, when we had nothing inside this cage, we could lean it down, put on the top pole, work all at, you know, at the proper height, and then once it's all assembled and working, then we just push it up and then we put the weight in. I, I, I like that model better. All right, so we're about to just park that ute up at the end of the airstrip here. And then we will roll onto Brumby and get cracking. Okay, so our top end assembly didn't go on until we were up the whole pole. So why don't I just drill rig sling it and screw it on up the top there? Yeah, you need to do that, or... We don't have to tilt it then. Yep. Try your try your thing, try your idea. We might, we're might we here to try things, so... Why have we got that? Oh, yeah, okay. okay. So what you want to do is put a... Screen. Yeah, no, I get it. But this, this is, so just... Okay. Uh, upside down. Right, and is that clean enough? No. So I've gone a short sling. Yeah. The long one wouldn't be better? Nah, short's better. Gives me more altitude. All right, get clear of it. 
Now, Jack, Jack, yeah, slightly. Coming in. Is that enough? No, you went the other way. You've got to go that way. Just don't do anything. Right, Tim, that is a big success. Big success? Huge success. Good. Oh, you want them back in here now? Yes, please. I like this one because it's shallower. The other one I think was tilted a little bit too steep, but I was too scared to say anything because you blokes are in the middle of one of those. No, and it's like, no, oh, no, that's super important. No, that's not important at all. Okay. Just drill thing. <laughs> just drill. <laughs> see, see, see. Whereas other ones you go to just. Oh, oh, oh no, no, no. Well, that's Dad getting Paco out of the way and lined up for tomorrow's job. But pretty happy. Like we didn't achieve as much as we thought we would, but we have done quite a bit. We resurfaced and repaired a tower. We got two, well, three water points up and running today. So that's Brumby there behind us and we're learning as we go, and that worked fairly well. But what that means is now we've got 24 seven view on here, which is pretty damn awesome. That's also another good check-in point. So as soon as it starts to dry up, we're gonna be able to start noticing our cattle coming in. And I haven't got any ice in the angle, but I've got oh. this. <laughs> so what is this, Jack? Well, it's just, it, it's not a trick. trick. It is not a trick, Ant. Yeah. It's hard, it's hard. But I'll give it a go. Oh. Yeah, that's nice. What's that? Bourbon. The Buffalo Trace. Never heard of it. It's not bad. It's not bad. I can drink it, Jack. But it's a lot better than cucumber. Well, there's plenty of cucumber here to go with your, your drink. <laughs> Thanks. But that's because we forgot to put beer in the angle and we make sure that we've got an emergency stash just in case you get a snake bite out here. Smart. Smart. Emergency supplies. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Right, well, we better uh, cramp into the car, make yes. sure nothing's going to blow off and yep. get home for a beer. Thanks everyone. Make sure you give us a thumbs up and if you're really enjoying, subscribe and we'll uh, see you as we keep going. <laughs>